Hey YouTube, welcome back guys. So since I got my uh, Samsung uh, S10 Plus, this is the most uh, expensive phone I ever own. And uh, when you get an expensive phone, you want to get a rugged uh, case to uh, protect your uh, investment. Today I'm trying to uh, demonstrate and show you guys the Amadillo uh, Tech uh, military uh, grade uh, case that I got. So let's go ahead and uh, show you guys real quick about the case. First one is this one. This is a uh, Amadillo Tech. And then this is the maroon uh, red color. This uh, is this is the Urban uh, Ranger series, which is a military gray rugged uh, protection. Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put this on and let you guys see. Oh, which one you guys uh, prefer? And inside, you got like a honeycomb uh, design. So let's uh, put this on and see. I like uh, this uh, double tag since uh, Samsung. I mean, I, I have I have been using uh, LG uh, V10 for the longest time, and I like the double tap, so the screen come on. But unfortunately, this one the double tap it does not go off. When when you tap double tap with the Sims, I mean the LG uh, V10, it uh, goes off. Okay, so it's already reading my face already since uh. It shows the unlock. Wow. So let's go ahead and then test this out real quick. All you need to do is just uh, put this on or slip it on. It does not matter uh, which way. All right. And then this is uh, what's it look like. You got the button volume rocker right here. It is uh, protected with this uh, TPU or silicone buttons. And also the Bixby uh, button right here. And all the lines uh, and then the holes are lined up correctly. You got your 3.5 uh, millimeter jack and your uh, USB type C, your microphone and your uh, speaker grill. And on this side is the power uh, button. And then there's your another microphone uh, hole right there. And this you got your triple uh, camera right there with your uh, LED flash. So as you can see on the left hand side right here, on the top and then on the bottom, you see how the silicone case is kind of raised up. So in case uh, this one, when you drop that on the ground, it's not going to, see, it's not hitting your glass or it's not going to crack your glass. It is uh, protective with those uh, bumper guard right there top and bottom but it might be a different story if you hit it on the side or on the edge okay so I was kind of surprised to see um, all the icons on the home page 
that I can rotate a uh, landscape. Unfortunately, you can't do it upside down, but you don't want to do that anyway. So and let's go ahead and uh, check out the uh, the other case real quick. So if you want to take it out, all you do is just uh, pop it out on the bottom or the top. So this is another uh, case that I got from uh, about the Am Amadillo uh, Tech Company. And then this one is called the Vanguard uh, Series. And I'm going to show you guys on how to uh, install this because this kind is this one is more than kind of difficult compared to this uh, burgundy one. The burgundy one is pretty simple and easy to insert it. So it's like a sandwich together. Okay, so let me show you guys real quick. This is like a hard plastic. And then this is the bottom. It's a rugged uh, military gray protection. And on the back on this one, it has a uh, three. Well, I don't know, three sixty degree rotation or two way uh, kickstand. Okay, I'm gonna show you that real quick. So before you put on this uh, case, you need to put on the frame first. Okay, make sure you line up everything, your microphone, your button and everything. So since uh, this button on this side has more button, I'm gonna put this one in first, okay? And all you do is just uh, make sure you wanna kinda lift up this uh, power button All right, and then it looks like that. So this is the tricky part right here. So as you can see right here, it's silicone too on the interior design. So this is the bottom. The bottom uh, go in first, okay? Since you got this uh, 3.5 millimeter jack, which is a plastic around the jack and then the USB type C that the plastic cut uh, it is uh, protruding so you want to go in uh, slide that one in first the bottom okay like that and all you do just uh, make sure the rubber part is going to sandwich with this uh, plastic on the edges and all around right and then that's it so this is a awesome case so i'm gonna stick with this one since i like i like the kickstand so when i ever i watch a video either the landscape i don't know why it's not reading my fingerprint i think i gotta do it again See this side. Try your biometric again in 18 seconds. So I guess it's uh, if you more, it reads uh, many times and it doesn't read your fingerprint. You gotta wait 25 seconds or something. I'm gonna use my face to unlock it. Oh no, I can't. I gotta wait. One second. Okay, now it's unlocked with my face. 
So I'm gonna play something real quick on YouTube and CS. But there's no ad. So I can put it this way and watch it. Oh, make sure you push in the rubber, I forgot to tell you. It's to protect the dirt and grimes or water get into the holes. So I want to allow you to go this way, upside down. All right, so this is compatible with the wireless uh, charging, okay? Either this one or that one, doesn't matter which one. Because they are uh, designed it that way. Because uh, before my wife, she has uh, like a metal ring on her uh, iPhone on the back of the case. And I was using the wireless uh, charger. And somehow her phone got so hot. I'm not sure if the metal ring uh, causing the phone to the kind of get overheat. Because uh, when I touch her, her on the back of her phone, it's like burning so hard, it's like burning my skin. So I tried this one. There's no problem with the wireless charging. It is compatible. Oh yeah, I forgot to uh, show you guys on how to take out this uh, case in case you guys want to take it out and remove it. Try not to struggle. Uh, you want to remove or separate the silicone of the plastic frame uh, since I have my long uh, fingernail I could just uh, use it so you, you might have to use like a guitar peg or whatever that you have so just make sure you separate them like a gap right here okay and then you just push it out slowly you don't want it on one side and then go on the other side all right and that separate the silicone already. Then you want to go down, then push it out. So you got the gap right there, and then you just push it. And then that's it. Okay? And then your phone is out. So be careful when you try to take it out, make sure you can uh, push this so it won't touch the button or scrape the button. So uh, since this side only got one button, I'm going to take it out from this side slowly. All right. You don't want to force it and yank it and then uh, break your button because I heard uh, this button is, those buttons are easy to come apart, but you can still push it back in. So hopefully you guys uh, give a thumbs up and then uh, like the video. Please uh, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Turn on the bell for notification or drop any comments on below. I got the other one right here. This is for the S10. So just kind of give you an idea that uh, I got so many different colors to uh, choose from. Okay. This is nice too with the two-way uh, kickstand. Okay. And this is like a grayish uh, silicone. I will include it within uh, a link within the description so you can check out the case. Yeah, so it doesn't hurt to go check it out. And uh, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. Like always, peace. <laughs>